All right, what's up? It's your boy here, Kid Absolute, and today we are watching Northern Ghana. So, if I'm not talking shit, let's get straight to the video. Ladies. You like the ladies? Yeah, I like ladies. <laughs> Best dads get promoted to grandpa. You like Miley Cyrus? Is that her name? You care, man, so I'm <laughs> fighting you white people big mess. White people are making a yeah. big mess? And then we come back to the car, and it's been clamped. The husband is a driver, and he travels a lot, but unfortunately, he has kicked the bucket. Hey, you mean he died? He died. <laughs> you got Louis Vuitton? So here I am in the public toilet, just on the side of the road, look at it. Low price are five cities. The price keeps going up. <laughs> The government is not good because uh, the way the government handles us, uh, we are suffering. So you're working 13 hours a day, a day just to get one or two meals? Yeah. This is for eating? Yes, yes. Is it nice? Yes. Yeah. If anybody robs or if anybody's a thief, he'll get killed. Are you head shopping? Yeah, I want to buy the head. What's the price for a head? How much? Price for head? You are suffering for Ghana too. Bad, very beautiful. What kind of metals are they looking for? Yeah, liars. Liars. Philip Oke, Jacobo. Johan Leke, Matthew. Simon Oke, Tadio. iPhone. Despite all the shit going on in that country, it's still a beautiful country. Like, I don't want niggas to get that shit messed up. Like, this shit is still a beautiful country. Even though there's, you know, so crazy things going on. Yes, we just Nazareth. Yeah, Galili man, let me. He's there. That's from the guy. So welcome to Tamale, one of the biggest cities in Ghana and the capital of the northern region. Completely different landscape, people, and the majority Muslim here. See how life compares compared to down in Accra where we've been, the capital city and the coast there, to up here in the north. You can definitely see a big, big difference. We flew here, about an hour's flight. Let's uh, go meet the people. <laughs> We basically pulled over just then. We hopped out and the driver went to grab some food. And then we come back to the car and it's been clamped. And then a huge fight started. But that's amazing efficiency. We pulled over for like two minutes and the car had been clamped in that short amount of time. What does that mean? Okay, so we're here with the butcher Abraham, right? Yeah. Okay, nice to meet you. This one is cow. Yeah, cow. This one is goat. Goat. This one is sheep. Sheep. Is life here easy or hard? The economy is just managing it. The economy is no good. No good. The price keeps going up. The price. Like the price. Right. Thank you, sir. So there's many different languages in Ghana. Uh, and, you know, the, the national language is English. So when you come here, you're coming with somebody from the south, like in Accra, and you come up here. They'll communicate in English. Quite a lot of people here speak English up here in the north as well, like they do in the south. This time is very difficult. Okay. The economy is very difficult. Right? Yes. What's the problem? Uh, the problem is, look, food stuff is is, is problem. Poor before to, to go to the farm. It's a problem. You understand? Yeah. Uh -huh. How to, to, to farm? It's a problem. Fertilizer is not there. Too, much, too expensive. Yes. Something I've noticed here is how many people ride bicycles and there's these big mechanic shops with these old parts oh, that they're they painting the up and okay. recycling, making nice new bikes out of them. Beautiful, fresh, green paint job here. We are used to corn. Corn? Yes, corn. Uh-huh. Uh -huh, and rice. Uh-huh. Now this time it's too, it's too high. So you can't afford to buy it? If you want to buy, you buy few. So you have to eat less now? Yes. Really? Yes. And what needs to happen to change that? Our leaders to, to, to do something about it. So you want the government to come and help with supplies and the equipment and things? Yes. To make yes. life easier? Yes. We don't know whether, whether this year will survive or will survive. Okay. Yes, mm. yes, I'm telling you. It's that bad? Yes. Okay. It's very, very, very bad. Thank you for your time. You're welcome. I appreciate that. Yeah, thank you. I got all the nuts and bolts here for the bikes. The whole workshop here. These are all ball bearings, so they sell all different kinds of ball bearings. 
Have you traveled to Accra before? Every week. I used to go to Kumasi. I get, I get, I get car, I buy pies. Right. Yeah. What's the difference between five years ago and now in the economy? Uh, it's a change. It's yeah. a change. Uh, proper change. And this is all because of petrol, is that right? The petrol, both the petrol and the diesel. If only the fall come down, we will hope that if the fall big down, so you want the government to bring the price uh, down? down. Right. Everything will change again. All right. Thank you very much. Your Thank, time. You too. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Appreciate it. So those guys that we were just talking to, uh, the mechanics, they were saying that most people are just, uh, a lot of people at least, are sitting around because there's just no opportunities and jobs here. And so they, they used to be mechanics, but now they're just sitting and just passing the time. And I asked them, has that led to an increase in crime? And they told me, if anybody robs or if anybody's a thief, he'll get killed. So there's this kind of like communal policing going on here. The government is not good because uh, the way the government handles us, uh, we are suffering. The way the, the petrol is going, our customers, they, they, they're lost, they don't want to come to market. Today, how many customers have you had? Because uh, we are loading our current to five. How many trips? So 25, I get uh, maybe four trips. Or four trips. trips, so like 20 people? 20 people that I think. Oh, okay, yeah. is that enough to buy food? In the morning I buy uh, rice. Rice? Uh, rice and beans. Rice and beans? One food. Okay, a day? A day, day I can take one or two, two. One or two meals a day? Yeah, a day. So you're working like 13 hours a day? A day. Just to get one or two meals? Yeah. Wow, that's hard, eh? No, it's hard, it's very hard. You know, people actually leave here and they head down to Accra to find better opportunities. And you've seen in Accra when we were there in Abu Bloshi, which is one of the main markets where they break down old computers, electronics, phones, either strip the copper from them or they sell the, the metals. And you saw how hard life was down there and the things that people are exposing themselves to, burning rubber to access metals and just, you know, shortening their life by being exposed to all these toxins. So if they're willing to put themselves through that, and this is where they're coming from, oh, then that kind brain. of shows the situation and how bad it is. Good morning from Tamale. Stayed in this pink hotel behind me here last night quite nice on the outskirts but we're about to drive back into the city hopefully it gives you a good grasp of the city here of tamale the northern capital mm. of ghana let's go into the city here and there's like you know the sewage goes into the drain there are you head shopping yeah i want to buy the head because it, it, Yusuf. it's expensive in Accra. so it's much cheaper up north yeah because this is where the most of the cow meat in ghana this is where they come from nice to meet you okay are you are you uh this is cow head that's a head yeah this is the cow head legs Oh, legs. Legs. Tail. 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 Oh, right, that's yes. the tail. Oh. That's the tail. Okay. So this is for eating? Yes, yes. Is it nice? Yes. Tasty? Uh, and this is the wow. legs. The yeah, legs. What's the price for a head? How that much? should look the good, price. boy. Put that with you some rice. Well, I mean, never chop. 200 cities. 200 cities for a head? Yes, for the head. How many heads do you sell a day? We are selling, uh, there, are, there are many. Many? How yes. many? 10, 20, 30. Life in Ghana is good. Yes, Ghana is good. <laughs> okay, thanks, brother. Okay. Good luck. Have a good day. Bye. Bye. Thank you. El Hassan, you were just saying that uh, when you were in school, you had pen pals pen from pals Canada and America. Canada, America. Okay. Yeah, Germany, even Spain. Okay. We have many friends, but we lost them. Oh, you lost them? Yeah, because of I don't find out in Facebook. Uh, so we lost contact with them. Right. But I need to get them. You need back. to find them, right? You need to find them. Maybe back. if they're watching the video, what was their name? Oh, we have Maria. 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 From Germany. From Germany. Hilda from USA. Hilda from USA. I have Hannah. Hannah. From Spain. All oh, ladies. Ladies. You like the ladies? Yeah, I like ladies. <laughs> All right, brother. Thank you so much. I appreciate your time. So you say you, you are from? New Zealand. New Zealand. Yeah. Okay. From the oh, south. It's a nice place. Yeah. yeah. Is, is this business a good business? Yeah, we do small, small. Small, small. Yeah, we do small, small. Right. So, you know, in Ghana here, the things are very difficult. 
economy. economy we need to and sometimes we need to, like, we are not going to school anymore. Not going so to school. Our business, how we are doing it. Right. Yeah, to get some to school. Everybody that I have met in Ghana says the same thing as you. Yeah, they say problem, problem. Yeah, yeah, very hard. Yeah. Very hard. Economy, yeah. very hard. Ukraine and some are fighting, the things no come, goods are. Ukraine? Yeah. We, we hear that we say here. The war? Yeah. Russia? So goods no they come, we know they get by them. The good, they so, cost, cost right so what now. you're saying, the, the war in Ukraine with Russia is, stop, is stopping goods yeah, arriving yeah, here and yeah. then that pushes oh. the prices up? Yeah. You white people, big mess, like my brothers. White people are making yeah. a big mess? Yesterday, two days. I won market. Nothing Maybe selling. 30 cities that I get. 30 cities in two days. Two days. Really? Zero. So how do you eat? We go, we, maybe if you don't have money, mm -hmm. come go and borrow your friend. Okay. Then CD, mm -hmm. tomorrow if you get, let me back. So Mohammed gives Abdullah mm. some money and uh, Abdullah uh, gives Mohammed some money. Maybe tomorrow if I get some right. money, I'll you help. Help. Oh, okay. Well, it's, right. it's beautiful though and that you're yeah, helping yeah, each other, yeah. eh? Yeah, that one day. Assalamu alaikum. You good? Good nice morning. to meet you. What's your name? Oh, my name is Mohammed. 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 Yes. Mohammed. Yeah, right. <laughs> how are you? I'm good. How are you? Oh, I'm so good. I'm just coming to experience Tamale. Right, okay. And meet the local people. Okay. Understand life. Okay. How is life? Okay, very, very good. <laughs> is, is life? Is, <laughs> you like that? <laughs> uh, it's good. Oh, thank you, Mohammed. <laughs> this is your house? Yeah. No. no. For outside. Right. Thank you, sir. No, don't remove your time. No, I don't want to disrespect your house. <laughs> oh, wow. You got Louis Vuitton? Oh, this is your jewelry? Yeah. Oh, wow. So you thread it. Yeah. Uh huh. What's the price for one bracelet that you make? Right now, that we have, uh, they are different. Okay. Low price are five cities. Maybe 20 cities. Do you guys have children? I yeah. have two children. Two kids? But he traveled. They traveled? Yeah. How old are they? Kids? One is four years. And they're traveling? Brothers, six years. They're traveling? Traveling. Yeah, they are traveling. Alone? Uh, yeah. Two and six? And go and see my mommy and come back. Okay. In the city? Yeah. Okay, so oh. they're just for the day. Yeah. And they come back and stay yeah. in your house. Yeah. So in five years from now, will be better or worse? Right now we are, we are not better. Okay. It's no, it's not going well. Mm. Thank so. you, Mohammed. Mm. And you know, the best thing Very about nice. them is that they're actually able to like, because a lot of people sit there and like, be mind wiped. You know what I'm saying? Just think that like, oh yeah, because like these people are like, they're understanding of their economy and knowing that like, yo, if things keep going the way that they're going right now. Things is not gonna get up. To meet you. Thank you. Thank you for instead of people thinking like a Next. false. Yeah. <laughs> Next. Next. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Yo. Do you like these people? Hi. All of them are something like that. Okay. <laughs> so the politicians are okay. Hi. They're okay. All of them are like that. Right. This man will say, "How oh, can I make like this?" He come to forget. Okay, so they say they'll promise something and then next minute it's gone. It's gone. Right, okay. Like this government. <laughs> right. Something like that. Oh, well, thank you, Mohammed. Nice to meet you. Eh? Yeah. <laughs> Aisha. Hello. Assalamu alaikum. <laughs> nice to meet you. So the husband is a driver and, and he travels a lot, but unfortunately he has the bucket. Hey, I mean he died. He died. Now the daughter has to come back to the mother. Yeah, Selling like different kinds of clothes. Yeah, small, small, small pants in for us. Right. The babies. Babies yeah. underwear. Yeah, underwear. What's the price for the Adidas? Three cities. Three, three, three cities. Yeah. Oh, it's good price. <laughs> yeah. How many items a day do you sell? Yeah, single, single. So she has been roaming since morning till now. It's only two cigarettes. 
that they've bought. And how much is that? The three and one, and they were 35. 35. Yeah. She showed the three in one set, only one set. For how much? For 35 cents. So, so she's made 35, 35 all, cents and she's been morning. walking around all morning. Uh -huh, five o'clock. So the moment. Start at five in the morning. Uh -huh. Yeah. So oh. the moment the the the, the, the until mom, now. Until now, she's back home to not to rest, but just to bath and refresh, and she will go back again. Shower. Shower. Okay. Just with the bucket. Okay. Do you have children? She has two kids. They are all in school. They're in school and they so live in this room? So she mostly sleeps on the floor while the children occupy the mattress. Are you happy with how the country is being run? They say these days things are very bad and it's not easy to take care of the kids. Patience is the key. And gradually, gradually, God will be able to help everybody. Michael's gone and made a purchase. He's bought a cow's head, right? Yeah, I got it for 180 cities. 180 cities. And then you come wow. in here and then you send money through your phone yeah. to his number. No, yeah, you can, I could have sent the money from here to his number. But he is not having the registered number for mobile wallet. Uh, so I have to come here, cash out, and give him cash. So you send oh, these okay. people the money and then they give you cash? Exactly. Okay. Yeah, okay. And you're going to, so when we go on the plane later, you're going to take the cow's head? Yeah, they're going to cut it into pieces. I tie it in a box. So you can keep it in your bag or in a box, any of them. <laughs> I think yeah. it'll make my bag smell great. Yeah, it smells very good. <laughs> Thank you. Bye. So this is ready to eat? Yes, yes. Okay. That still looks good. good. 80. 30. So you give me one quick. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. So you can keep the change. Keep it. <gasps> hey, I remember Thank those, you. bro. I've been bound yet. Yeah. What's in the bag? Corn. Corn? Corn. What's the price for one bag? No, I'm bad at price. 440. And are you doing this business or are you doing something else? I'll jump there in one second. Are you are you doing this? Are you working here? No, this is our car. Oh, uh, you're you're driving yeah. the truck. Where did you drive from today? Oh, from Kema. Kema. So we are going to Kaswan. Okay. How many hours? It depend on how you work. On the right. Road. And how old are you? I'm 25. 25. And how long have you been doing this job? It's not too long. Like a, a few years or? Oh no, it's not. Maybe a week. Thank you for your time. Oui. Appreciate it. Thanks very much. Appreciate Jesus, it. Jesus, it's 11 Cheers. hour drive. Thanks, guys. Bye. So the damn it looked like as if you're going here nowhere. In Somale and the north of Ghana, it's very similar to Kano in northern Nigeria, which uh, if you saw my Nigeria series, you would recognize this looks very similar. Even the language is the same in some parts. The people, the religion, the landscape, Ghana and Nigeria have a pretty good relationship. They've had similar histories in part. People in both countries are, are great, really charismatic, outgoing people. Uh, many people speak English in both countries, which is really nice to come and interact with the people here. So they're selling cooking oil here. You've got to be careful because some, some places I've just seen also sell petrol in the same bottle. So you've got to make sure that you don't oh. put petrol in your pan when you're cooking. So it says, no, best no. dad pr get promoted to grandpa. No, no. Oh, okay, okay. Snob, snob, snob. Yeah, yeah. Looks good. <laughs> Oh, he was just wearing the shirt. How do I pronounce your name again? Zephal. Zephal. Yeah. Well, nice yeah. to meet you. Nice to meet you. This is your boy? Yeah. Ah, oh, he's beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so you're making all kinds of clothes here? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Is this a good business? Um, no. No, not good? Yeah. Why? The material is 
hard. So Expensive. Fabrics yeah. look beautiful. Things are getting harder yeah. every day. Yeah. As a mother, what mm. is life like here in the north? Uh, Hot. Mm. Yeah, it's like 36 <laughs> degrees right now. It's so hot. It was lovely You're to meet welcome. you. I appreciate your time. Good luck. Good luck. Thank you. You're welcome. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye. Just such lovely people here. It's incredible, honestly. That's the thing is that all these people know how to make a... Now we're coming to make a light of a bad Michael's situation. Michael's cow head, no? because they've been smoking it while we've been walking around. It should be ready for pickup now. How's it going? Is it ready? And I believe that's what really makes somebody beautiful. Yeah. You know what I mean? Which like, one? This one or that one? This one. That's, that's Michael's? Yes. Okay. Okay, so I've met a, a local man, El Hassan, right? You mentioned that you'd actually seen some of my videos before? Yes, I have. I have seen your video where you travel to Somalia, Somalia. And Pakistan. And you really Pakistan. want to travel, right? You want to go and see other cultures? Yes, yes that, that would be fun. That would be fun, you know. Right. Experiencing the other cultures. Why do you want to see other cultures? Because life is not really stagnant, you know. It's okay. not like a, a, a stationary position. Keep the momentum going. Yeah, that's, that's, that's it. Yeah. Right, and what if you could go to one country, what would it be? Can you give me, like, Top five? US, Venezuela, North Korea. I'm, I'm really curious about right. that country. I want to see how life is over there. Pleasure meeting you. Thank you very much for your time. This is yours. Yeah, that's my meat. So he's chopped the head into pieces. Good, yeah, yeah, yeah. boy. Is it cooked? Oh, it is cooked. I think so. Or it's just roasted to like preserve it. Graphics. <laughs> I don't understand. You like Miley Cyrus? Is that her name? Yeah. Okay, maybe that's my first time knowing her name. I like only the body, I don't know the name. <laughs> that's beautiful. Now it's your boy Kid Absolute. I love y'all. And I'll catch y'all in the next video. Peace.